That is so cool. A sharp teeth like the flower's gonna bite you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you like ice cream? Everybody likes ice cream. Okay, the Halloween stuff is right in here as soon as you walk in the door. They did a great job of decorating this place this year. This one, I already love this. He's got a brain. That is sweet. We got a nice little happy face jack-o'-lantern. There's a light in there. I wonder if we can get that light up. Is there a light in here? Yes, there is. Let's see. Okay, I had to pull a tab, but look at that. It's red. That is sweet. I would love to have that on my desk. Got a jack-o'-lantern here. Let's get him lit up and see what happens. Check this out. Okay, he's orange. And you can't see him as well as you can see the red in here. This one looks amazing. It looks like somebody already turned this one on and it's green. Check that out. What is this even? It almost looks like a potion bottle. Yeah, it's like a poison bottle. I like the green inside that they used for the uh, poison. That is so awesome. And there's a serpent slithered all around it. Here's another awesome one. It's a heart. Guys, these are awesome. I'd have to pull the tab on that one to get it to light up. But there's a sticker in the way and I don't want to pull the sticker off. Look at the ghost. I love ghosts. Ghosts. That is awesome. I pulled the tab on the ghost. Look at him. He's yellow. They chose perfect colors for these. I like that they didn't just fill it with regular lights. They did colored lights, and I love the yellow on there. I imagine these other ones down here light up too. There's a ginormous skull. Look at this thing. Okay, there's no light in this one, so you put your own light in that. Here's a bunch of the uh, spooky town things. Paul's pumpkin patch. Here's a, uh, what is this one? It's like a covered bridge. That is sweet. There's a snake on the roof. There's a little cat. I like the cat. Wigs. A wig shop. That is cool. This one is sick. Look at this. A flowing green creepy fountain. <laughs> Look. There's a, a dead guy down there with a cup like he was drinking the poison. Another snake. Wow, they really like snakes here. Creepy, rotten candy. Oh, this is like the uh, ground that you put it on. Here's a big castle, and it's got witches on the top. I imagine when you turn it on, they spin. Yes, they fly around atop of this creepy witch cabin. A dungeon of terror. That's pretty cool. And look, it's got dragons or something. There's people like exploring the dungeon and they have a ton of stuff here to decorate your little creepy town like people this guy he's like a grave digger and he's got a body that he's dragging there's a foot coming out of the bag that is so awesome guys they have a ton of these spooky town things okay here's another one we'll go through these real quick creatures pet shop and there's a bat on the top samantha's supernatural yard decor scarecrow joe it must be his home gothic hills funeral parlor this one is sweet Sweet. What is this thing? Mystery Meat Company? That is hilarious. It's got a brain in there going into the grinder to make the mystery meat. That is so funny. I wish they had some of these set up so we could actually see them operating. Check this out. We've got some awesome little blow molds here. I seen this one. Somebody posted a video of this one and it is awesome. That ghost right there pops in and out behind the gravestone. That thing is sweet. And here's some blow mold ghosts. I love it. He's got the jack-o'-lantern can collector. Here's a little ghost we can press a button on. Ooh, he changes colors. Purple, green, blue. I love that. Even red. Whoa. Here's some more light up things like uh, string lights and stuff. Jack-o'-lanterns with faces. Happy Halloween. <laughs> Happy Halloween. That is so funny. Let's see what the ghosts do. I love it. <laughs> that is so cool. And the lights work really well on that too. They're super bright. So you wouldn't even have to have that in the dark. You could see it without it. These are awesome. They're like ornaments in case you want to decorate a Halloween tree. We've got bats. I love the orange bats. That is funny. Ghosts, skulls, jack-o'-lanterns. Here's the cats, the scaredy cats. How cool is that? I think I saw some eyeballs over here, but look at this. Whoa, I love the colors. That is awesome. So if you like to decorate a Halloween tree, look, they even have Halloween trees. Six foot pre-lit black tree. Here's those eyeballs I was talking about. I love the pillows. I need to get some for my couch. He's got a scaredy cat, a bat. I love the bat. How much is that? $25. A little pricey, but I do like it a lot. And we've got this black skull. Here's some shiny scaredy cats. I love it. I'd love to have these on my desk. I don't know which one I'll get though. Look at the tail all fluffed up. I wish they did like something like that on his back too. So it looked like all the fur was standing up on his back like he's scared. Here's a purple one. That is so hilarious. I love it. And the orange. And I like these. I've seen these at other stores. I think I saw this at the dollar store. Look at the ghosts. I love that shiny tinsel that they use for these. They even 
even have it on these jack-o'-lanterns. There's some more pillows. I love the ghost. Look at this ghost. $30 for the ghost. A little pricey, but worth it. Man, I would love to have about six of those on my couch. And there's some bats. It looks like they're flying in front of an orange moon. This eyeball looks like a snow globe, but it's not. There's a button. Let's see what it does. Ooh. So in the dark, that would look really cool. This is funny. I think this pillow has legs. Yeah, look. It's a skeleton pillow, and he has legs. That is too funny. I love ghosts. So this is a nice, simple little ghost with bendy arms that you can pose. $13. Not too bad. Look at his cheery face. Here's some smaller ones, too. These are $5 each, and they also have a nice, spooky, cheery face. I love his mouth on there. Plenty of fall things down that aisle, but we're looking for spooky stuff, so we're going to move right over here. Check this out. A wreath hanger that has a skeleton hand on it. That's pretty cool. This is awesome. At the dollar store, we saw flowers that had eyeballs on it, but look at this. It's flowers with a mouth. That is so cool. A sharp teeth, like the flower's going to bite you. And this one has a skull in it. That's pretty cool. They have some awesome stuff here. Check this out. It's like a goblet. I don't know if that's a goblet or a floral container. Okay, so it holds flowers, but it's a black heart. Here's a skull that is labeled. That's pretty cool if you want to be spooky and also be educated. This reminds me of Groot. I bet that's what Groot's skull would look like. I don't know what these are. I guess you would put some kind of decorations in them, but it looks like a bubble. That's pretty cool. And they've got beakers. That is sweet, like science beakers. And look at this. They've got a jar full of flies. That is awesome. I love it. I did not expect to see that we've got glow-in-the-dark skulls bones look at that these are all glow-in-the-dark skulls here there's some bigger ones there i love the flies though that's my favorite here's some snakes all kinds of spooky stuff here to make some kind of like floral things here like check this out black hands that is crazy and creepy if you are making your own prop you could totally come here and use some of the stuff they've got here's some little ghosts oh these are like bouquets but it's ghosts and bats here's some venus fly traps okay there's more spooky stuff over here but what caught my eye is this stuff right here yes these are door greeters and stuff let's check out what the owl does you press the skull on his chest whoa keep a watch eye when you enter <laughs> you never know who or what you never you know encounter. that is funny i love it i wonder if he says anything else welcome welcome i hope you were not easily spooked i have some surprises that await that is awesome. I love it. Here's another one. Dead end. Probably an eyeball in there. Yes. Oh my gosh. That's the coolest eyeball I've ever seen on one of these doorbell things. That is awesome. I love the color on that eyeball. Here's another one. Looks like kind of like witch's hands. Yes. Halloween night is just the beginning for scary moments in your life. That is so cool. It's like a crystal skull. Let's do it one more time. That is cool. Check this out. Light up tombstones. That's pretty cool. Here's a light up crystal ball. I do love the crystal balls. Those are awesome. Here's some uh, what looks like witch's brew. Light up potion bottles. Those are sweet. Look at this animated witch. She's got spiders on her face. That is so awesome. Man, I wish they had some of these set up. Here's one of the animated books. So it looks like a ghost is pulling out the books. But this cat, the skeleton cat, turns his head, probably meows and his eyes light up green. Here's a skull with a couple of crows on top. That is super freaky. Oh, it looks like his uh, wings, the wings uh, flap. That is awesome. I would love to see that. Man, they totally got to get some of this stuff set up in here. Here's a uh, tree, animated tree. I love the creepy trees. Look at that. He talks and it looks like maybe his arms move. There's another one of the snakes. Man, they love snakes here. They do have some of the glow-in-the-dark skeletons here. I love these. I kind of want to compare all the prices at the different stores because a lot of people have these. $85. Here is a whole other aisle of creepy stuff. This is hilarious. There's a cat and he's got a mouse hanging in his mouth. That's so funny. Please work. Yes, the lights in his eyes. Here's an eyeball snow globe. Let's, without breaking it, try to get it going. Yeah. I do love this. <gasps> Those are bats in there. That is awesome. That is cool. I do like that a lot. This is a hilarious crow. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. 
That is so funny. I love how raggedy he is. <laughs> this is kind of interesting. Here's some more stuff that you just set on your mantles and stuff and decorate your house with. But look at this. It's Edgar Allan Poe sitting on a toilet. What is that about? Oh my gosh. What is the toilet about? That is so funny. I, he'd be rolling in his grave if he knew that they made him sitting on a toilet as a decoration. Small versions of the glowing skeletons for $27. Not too bad. Guys, that is super awesome. Look at these little little hanging things here. We've got a clown. Here's a pirate one. I love that. That's my favorite. Here's a little bag of smaller skeletons. That's pretty cool. Here's a bag of eyeballs. All right. That's sweet. I love the eyeballs. Look how detailed that is. That is so cool. These are like the best eyeballs that I have ever seen at a store before. Here's some more eyeballs right here. These ones are like foam. Those ones were plastic and hollow. These ones are foam. Still very detailed. They're green like my eyes. These are baby heads or something like doll heads that is super creepy plenty of skulls here these are super awesome and they're foam here's some little tombstones in case you want to set up your own graveyard a little mini graveyard look at this bags of worms that is so cool and look they've got to have the snakes snakes are a big thing here at michael's i suppose here's a skeleton unicorn and they have a ton more skeletons here all kinds of sizes and look at these ones super colorful pink and yellow wow